And now the brigade major and four troopers of the night guard move up. Leading Her Majesty, the Queen, and members of the royal procession on the first part of this birthday parade, the inspection of the line. Mass bands play medley of old Scottish songs. since March 1975, after 22 years as Colonel of the Welsh Guard. Prince of Wales is Colonel of the Welsh Guard since St David's Day, 1st of March 1975. And the Duke of Kent is Colonel of the Scots Guard, the regiment who are trooping here. Major Richard McFarlane of the Coldstream Guard having served overseas for some years, is with me once again. And he's taken part in this parade many times, and now he perhaps views it with fresh eyes. Well, the parade changes very little. And for any guardsman, this is always an important day. Each parade has its own definite and very special individual character. Inspection is the first of five main parts that make up the parade. After the inspection comes the proof by the mass bands, which is a splendid marching and musical display in slow and then quick time. Then the third part of the parade is the actual ceremony of trooping the colour through the ranks, the ceremony from which the parade takes its name. This is followed by the march past in slow and quick time by the foot guards, and finally the fifth part of the parade, the rank passed by the high cell cavalry at the walk and the trot. approaching the corner that is the junction between five and six guards, found today by the second battalion Grenadier guards. And then on to number seven and eight guards, found by the first battalion Coastering guards, stationed in the royal town of Windsor. Majesty will salute the colour to her right. of Wales, Duke of Kent, and Lord Mike Now followed by, on the left, the Master of Horse, the Duke of Beaufort, and on the right, the Gold Stick in Waiting, Field Marshal, Sir Joel Temple. And they're followed by the Crown of Query and the Aquarius in Waiting. And then on the greys, the Colonel of the Coastream Guards on the left, and the Colonel of the Irish Guards on the right. And then Major General John Swinton, the Major General commanding the Household Division, and all the troops on the raid today. Silver stick in waiting. And on the left, the Chief of Staff, London District, and the ADC to the Major General, Captain Balfour. Majesty is now moving in rear of the line of guards to start our inspection of the high cell cavalry. We are lined up in the rear of the parade and in front of the guards' memorial. Music in line with the Scottish flavour of today's parade is the Quick March Highland Gathering. Cavalry standard as she passes. This is the sovereign standard of the lifeguards. It bears the royal coat of arms and most of the battle honours of the regiment. And finally, to 
then the inspection, the massed mounted bands, which comprises musicians from both the lifeguards and the Blues and Royals band, with the state trumpets. His Royal Highness the Duke of Edinburgh, whose birthday it was yesterday. It is, of course, the Queen's official birthday today. Our own personal birthday is on the 21st of April.